Hello gamers and welcome back to Addicted to News. As E3 grows closer, we all anticipate seeing the next big game, but until then, we'll keep delivering the best gaming news to you. First up, Rockstar has announced that the GTA Online heist will finally see the light of day on consoles on March 10th. Unfortunately for PC gamers, their version of the game has been delayed yet again until April 14th and it's due to them still needing time to polish the game. Also, gamers have waited since late 2013 when GTA 5 launched to play the rumored heist missions, and after a long wait, we finally will get to. Up next, rumor has it that a new Guitar Hero game is in production at Activision and will be revealed at E3. The game will feature a more realistic art style and there will be new instruments made for the game. They also say that they would only like to bring the franchise back if they can create something unique for newer gaming platforms. Moving on, the Xbox Games with Gold program in March will bring Bioshock Infinite and Tomb Raider to Xbox 360 for free, as well as Rayman Legends and iDarb on Xbox One. Also to note is that along with the listed games, there's a note stating that in April, the program will offer double the free games, which would be awesome. Our final story of the day brings us news of a Wii U adapter that allows you to play the console with a PS3 or PS4 controller. You simply plug the adapter into the bottom of a Wii remote, plug your USB cable from your DualShock controller into the adapter, and you're set to use a PlayStation controller on Wii U. It seems that the adapter is only available in Japan at the moment, so you'd have to import one if you'd like to get your hands on it. As far as price, the adapter costs the equivalent of 22 and a half US dollars. Thanks for watching. Please click that like button if you enjoyed the video, and as always, never stop gaming. Let's go.